Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Oh, I need to go get dressed, hold on a second. I will just put on my Green Bay Packers sweatshirt. I always walk around the house in my sports bra and pants like before I go out anywhere and I completely forgot to put a top on, so just hold on a second. That's how comfortable we are on YouTube, right? <laughs> anyway, let me just zip on up here. Um, okay, she's dressed. She's not ready hair-wise, but she's dressed. I just got out of the shower, just did my makeup, and um, it's bright outside, you guys. It is sunny. So first and foremost, I just wanted to um, say thank you guys so much to everyone who was giving me love about Snooky Louise. I am much better now after hearing all of your comments just knowing that I like did the right thing for her putting her out of pain and um knowing that you know she definitely made a difference um to me not only but to you guys so um that was quite reassuring anyway so I have Rocky here with me we are going to go to my mom's house for the first time today, Mr. Rocky is going to meet Caesar, my mom's dog. So, um, ugh, I don't know how to break this to you guys. Unfortunately, I have some more bad news. So, if you guys have been following me for a while, you'll know that my mom has two dogs. Caesar, which is um, a Shih Tzu, just like Rocky Rococo, actually almost the same coloring as him as well. And she also has Gatsby, who is a Yorkie that she um, rescued basically from one of her friends, um, the, well, a friend's relative, I guess. The dog was abused and um, when she rescued it, it was a year old. Oh my goodness, baby, this little muffin of a man, this little, oh my goodness, you going to say hi to the peoples? He has some little, um, oh, some little snarls in his beard that he won't let me touch. I try, I try to touch them and he will not let me. He says, no, 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 missus. So anyway, um, I had to put Snooky down on Tuesday and my mom called me Wednesday letting me know that her dog, uh, Yorkie Gatsby, had been having some medical problems and she made an appointment for him at the doctor and it turned out to be more serious than what she thought. And unfortunately, she had to put him down on Thursday. Wednesday? Yeah, Thursday. Uh, so yesterday. So she was completely devastated um, and it was very crazy to me that we both lost dogs the same week um you know I really didn't bond with her dog neither did anyone else in our family but she bonded with the dog the dog meant something to her um which you know it's devastating to see anyone in pain and I understand her pain um I you know was able to enjoy Snooky for a very very long time where her dog, I think, was maybe three years old. He might have even been only two. I don't know, like two and a half, three. Um, so that was kind of devastating. He had had some liver problems and just other issues that was going on. Um, and he took a turn for the worse. So we are going to go over there today, hopefully to make her day a little bit brighter and like I said, Rocky is going to meet Caesar for the first time. Uh, they have never met my mom's other dog that she had to put down. He was kind of an aggressor uh, towards my, towards Snooky Louise at least. And so ever since I, ha like we had that episode happen where he was showing aggression towards her, I haven't been over there with the dogs just because I don't need to have them be around that behavior. It'll be interesting to see how he does with another dog. Like he did really well with Snooky Louise, but I don't know how he's been or how he will do with another dog, especially another male dog. He's only known another female dog. So it'll be interesting to see. But anyway, I'm going to go do my hair and get ready. I have to be out of the parking lot here where I live um, at three o'clock because they're going to be 
cleaning up everything. So from three to six is when I'm going to be at my mom's house. And I might vlog a little bit um, while we're over there. But oh my goodness, baby, you just want to go nine night night. He's tired. Okay, you guys, I put my makeup on and I did my hair. The first I think I've done since Tuesday. Um because it's just been crazy. And I took my shirt off again because I got too hot. You know, the hormones and everything. Um, But I forgot to tell you guys, something really, really exciting happened last night. And it was unfortunate that I didn't take the opportunity and be a yes girl. I had to be the no girl. Um, So Trixie Mattel contacted me on Instagram and on um, TikTok and followed me. I mean, she was already following me on Instagram, but she followed me on TikTok and she reached out. Um, she sent a PM and um, or DM or whatever the bum fuck you call it. And she w invited me to her show and was going to give me free tickets because she was performing in Oshkosh last night. And I mean, with my mom putting her dog down and it was like kind of short notice. It wasn't really like short, short notice. It was in the morning. Um, and I was just, my mindset just wasn't there because of Snooky and stuff too. Um, so unfortunately I didn't go, but I was invited and that was super, super cool. It was like an honor to be invited or to be given free tickets for something like that. Like that is super, super cool. So I was really excited about that, but really, really sad that I wasn't able to go. Um, so I'm going to have to reach out to her again and thank her for the offer. I, th I don't even know what I said to her yesterday because I was like so flustered because of everything that has just been going on. Um, oh, Rocky's crying in my room. You hear him? So he does this thing where he takes certain toys. It's not like every single toy that he has. It's just like certain ones. And he'll put them in his mouth and he'll go into my room and he'll cry. I hear him. It's okay, baby. Or he'll go underneath my bed and he'll cry. And he was doing this long before the whole Snooky Louise saga. So, um, you know, this is not anything new. I don't know why he does it, but it's just like unexplained crying or unexplained whining um I also witnessed this type of behavior I was actually watching YouTube and one of my trail camera videos came up because I like I watched the trail cams you know because the DNR and all that kind of stuff um in Wisconsin and they had one of a baby wolf and it was in the wild and it was calling for his mother. And this is the exact sound that he does that that baby wolf was doing. So I don't know if he's like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know if it's some sort of dog language that I just don't understand. I don't know. I'm not sure. Of course, you know, today. Hey guys, so Caesar was just too big for Rocky Rococo. Rocky was really scared, kind of intimidated, so it's going to take a while, I think, for him to get used to him, but I am going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching, um, and yeah, again, thank you guys so much for the well wishes for myself and the um, really, really nice words of encouragement about Snooky Louise. That's really greatly appreciated. So I hope everyone has a great day and I will see you guys all later. Bye everyone.